Hey everyone, John here from testpreppinsight.com and today I'm going to be covering our list of the best FE exam prep courses heading into 2025. We've purchased and re-reviewed a bunch of different FE exam review courses and study materials over the last couple months and today I'm going to break down the top three prep resources that we found based on our ratings. And by the way, since this is just going to be a shorter video and I'll just be covering the high points today, if you find you need some more detail at any point during this video, we also have a full written guide over on our website that has way more information. The quickest way to find that article is probably just to Google Test Prep Insight Best FE Exam Prep Courses. That's the quickest way to get there. All right, so to get right into it, after reviewing a bunch of different FE exam review courses, practice exam bundles, and study materials, the package that got our highest overall rating this year is the prep course from PPI to Pass. We've reviewed their course three or four times now, and they have made some really nice improvements to their prep package over the last year or so that we just love. And now we think it's honestly the best prep resource that you can use. So let's break it down. And by the way, I forgot to mention that we actually reviewed the FE civil exam prep courses and study materials from each company, so keep that in mind. We didn't look at mechanical or environmental or any of the other disciplines, though to be fair, I would strongly suspect that they're all very similar in terms of setup and quality. But anyway, just wanted to share that. So back to PPI and why they get such a good rating. And for us, it all starts with their live classes. They are simply the best in the space. The PPI instructors have such a good grasp of the material tested on the exam, and they are really good communicators as well, which in a way I think is almost more important. Plus the PPI lesson plans are very efficient with their time and the progression of the class series is methodical, moving from topic to topic, building up on foundational knowledge, working up to more advanced subjects. Plus after each class, you're assigned targeted homework that reviews what you learned in class and primes you for the next session. So bottom line, we were just really impressed with the live classes and if you plan to make live instruction a central component of your study plan, whether just because you need that accountability and commitment that comes with a set class schedule or you just want your hand held throughout the process, then PPI is our pick for that. Then another aspect of why PPI gets our top grade is their written study materials. Just to give some context here, PPI's written manuals are so authoritative that some of their prep courses even use the PPI written materials as the basis of their work. And I'll actually have more on that in a minute. But for purposes of the FE exam, when you sign up with PPI to pass, you'll get a digital copy of their FE exam review manual based on your discipline. Again, for us, it was the FE civil review manual. And although we do kind of miss the old school hard copy version of the review manual, the ebook format is actually really cool because it allows you to read a chapter, then hyperlink over and solve related practice problems from your practice book. And this just gives the course a very cohesive feel and easy to use functionality. So although we miss the print version, the digital version is actually a massive improvement. Plus the manual itself provides amazing detail in a way that's still somehow very readable and usable. They do a great job of taking these mass amounts of material and distilling it down to the most essential elements while still providing the detail where it's needed. So in short, the PPI written materials are just light years ahead of everyone else's. And then the final thing that I'll say about PPI to pass is that they provide more practice material than any other prep provider. PPI gives you close to 3,000 practice problems, which is like three times as much as you get with other companies, and two full-length mock exams, which is great. There is a very strong correlation between FE exam pass rates and quantity of practice material work, so this is a huge bonus. Plus, we found the practice problems to be very realistic of what you'll see on test day, and the accompanying solutions were solid as well. So basically, PPI also scores big points with us for their practice work. Now, to this point, it's been all good news, but if there is one major drawback with PPI, it's the price tag. The PPI Live Online course costs around $1,800, which is not cheap, and even their on-demand package with six months of access, which is probably about what you'll need to study, is $1,500. So no matter how you cut it, PPI is on the expensive side. Kind of like most things in life, it's a top-tier study product, so they charge top-tier prices. But the one thing I'll say here is that PPI does run pretty frequent discounts, so make sure to check for coupon codes and sales before buying. In fact, I'm actually going to do my best to keep the description down below updated with the most current discounts and promo codes that I can find floating around out there for all the companies that I'll be discussing today. So make sure to check out that text below the video screen and maybe save yourself some money. If this does end up being the right course for you, you should not have to pay full price with PPI. All right, so a very close second to PPI to pass in terms of ratings and substantive content is School of PE. Here's why we like their prep program their course structure, the self-paced video lectures, and a really good review guide. Let's take those in order. 
So when you're looking at the structure of this course, everything is very intuitively laid out. From the dashboard, all of your instructional material and practice work is neatly bucketed into sections under a course materials tab based on topic. Everything is just very tidy and easy to follow, which benefits learners that are more organized and like to work through materials systematically. And as for what's in these folders, each one is basically a learning module for that particular topic. These are made up of five different components, written study notes, workshop problems and solutions, video lessons, quizzes, and flashcards. I'm not gonna drill into the detail on each one of these elements since we have a separate review video on School of PE that gets into all of that great detail, but just know that we found this course structure to be very intuitive and effective. Then the second highlight is the on-demand video lectures. They're definitely not the flashiest videos out there, but we love them from a content perspective. You'll see your instructor's face up in the corner while they go through slides, marking them up and explaining concepts and solving sample problems as they go. It's a straightforward approach that we found to be effective, and we had a really good experience with the School of PE lecturers. And then the last thing that I want to touch on is the School of PE review guide that they ship you when you sign up. We reviewed the FE Civil Exam Review Guide, but of course there's also separate review guides for the different disciplines. But anyway, this review guide was incredibly good. It contains key notes, equations, cross-references to the reference handbook, and sample problems. It does a really nice job of tracking with and complementing the primary lesson work. So that's why we like School of PE's prep course. They provide a nice combination of effective course structure, video lessons, and written study materials. Plus, School of PE also has the added benefit of being a slightly better value than PPI to pass. School of PE's live online courses typically cost around $1,500, which is about $300 cheaper than PPI, and their on-demand course typically costs around $1,200, again, about $300 cheaper than PPI's comparable package. So it's a pretty good value for what you get. And then even at that, School of PE usually allows you to stack the sales discounts on their website with coupon codes so you can kind of compound the savings, which can be big, so make sure to check for that. Again, I'll have those links down below for you. Then lastly, the final course that I want to talk about today is Civil Engineering Academy. Of all of the different courses and study bundles that we reviewed, they're likely the best value that we encountered. For a little under $800, the Civil Engineering Academy course costs about half of what other prep companies charge. It is just simply a great value. And to be clear, this isn't some budget bare bones course here. Civil Engineering Academy includes some really solid study materials that we graded out highly. In terms of substance, the course is built on 14 learning modules that deliver video lectures from the two course founders, hundreds of practice problems with video explanations and breakdowns, two full-length mock exams, and in terms of written study material, remember how I said earlier on in this video that other courses use the PPI review manual? Well, Civil Engineering Academy is one of them they leverage the PPI review manual as part of your learning in each module. But anyway, just to kind of help explain how this course works a little better, through the course video lectures, the two founders and instructors provide a high level overviews of the most important equations for that topic. They talk about how the exam tests you on that subject, and then they'll dive into some sample problems to demonstrate how the concepts play out in practice on the exam. These modules are very well structured with a natural flow to them, and we especially like the downloadable lecture slides that you can take notes in as you follow along. Plus, the other highlight of the Civil Engineering Academy course is the fact that you get video solutions accompanying every practice problem. These videos rely heavily on references to equations in the reference handbook, which you get during the exam, and the visual breakdowns that they provide offer a ton of value. So basically, when you combine the structured learning modules with the realistic practice problems and video explanations, it's a powerful little combo. Now, with all that said, there are two drawbacks to going with Civil Engineering Academy. Let's be clear about this. First is the fact that there are no live classes. That's kind of a bummer for students needing live instruction. But second is the fact that the course is only offered for the civil version of the FE exam. If you're taking the mechanical exam or another discipline, unfortunately, this course is not gonna work for you. But otherwise, if you're pretty self-driven and want a self-paced on-demand study tool for the FE Civil, then Civil Engineering Academy is a great value at $800. And even at that, we do sometimes see Civil Engineering Academy knock five or 10% off the price, so make sure to check for coupon codes. Again, I'll have those down below for you. But anyway, that's kind of it for this video, so let's wrap it up with some final thoughts here. But before I forget, I should just mention that since you're studying for the FE exam, we actually give away a free prep course every single month to one lucky person. It's really easy to enter. Just do the three simple things listed right here on screen. It'll take you less than 10 seconds and hey, you never know, you could win a totally free FE exam prep course. 
Okay, so my final verdict, which course should you go with to study for the FE exam? Well, after repurchasing and reviewing all of these different courses, I honestly think PPI to pass is the way to go these days. They are simply the best out there. Their written study materials are light years ahead of competitors. Their live online classes are hyper efficient and very effective. They offer more practice material than any other FE exam prep provider, and they even have a pass guarantee. So although this course is a little pricey, for those reasons, if it were me, I would go with PPI. But anyway, I hope this video has been helpful. If so, please subscribe to our channel and best of luck in your prep journey.